Now, when we talk about generational talents, we talk about guys like Mike Trout, Shohei Otani, Vladimir Guerrero Jr., Fernando Tatis Jr., and even Aaron Judge. But we don't talk about one guy. One guy who is one of the best pure hitters in all of baseball today. That guy is Jordan Alvarez. Now, there are many things that make Jordan special. The fact that he's able to drive a baseball 450 feet in any ballpark, his ability to drive a pitch to the opposite side of the field, his ability to shoot the ball in the gaps, his baseball IQ is higher than a lot of people think. But there's this one trait about Jordan, this one thing that separates him from most of the players players in the league and when I show you these numbers you might be surprised to me Jordan Alvarez is one of the most disciplined hitters in the league what's so impressive about that is the fact that he's a pure power hitter he is a monster of a man when you get DHs and monster power hitters like this guy usually they want to swing at a lot of things usually they have high strikeout rates usually they have high swing and miss rates and high whiff rates all right contact rates but Jordan is different Jordan's stats and baseball savant show exactly just how good he is. And I'm going to put this on the screen for you right now so you can see and understand exactly what I'm talking about. Now to make my point and drive it home, I pulled four of probably the best hitters in the game today. Vladimir Guerrero Jr., Aaron Judge, Shohei Otani, and Mike Trout. K rate, chase rate, and whiff rate. These are the three stats that to me show exactly just how patient and great Jordan is at seeing balls and understanding exactly what to do with them and what he's looking for. Now look at these numbers, you'll see that Jordan has the lowest K rate out of all of them. Look at these numbers, you'll see that Jordan has the second lowest chase rate out of all these guys. And look at these numbers, you'll see that Jordan has the second lowest whiff rate out of all these guys. And who is the only guy that's above him? Who is the only guy on this list? that has better numbers than Jordan in these departments. And that, sir, is one generational talent in Mike Trout. That's right, Mike Trout, who may become the best baseball player of all time. Jordan Alvarez is only trailing him in chase rate and whiff rate. And if that's not enough for you, these aren't career stats. These are just for this year. If you pull up career stats, they get even more shocking. Now looking at the numbers over a career time for these guys, you see that Jordan Alvarez has a lower K rate than all but Vladimir Guerrero Jr. and Mike Trout. If you look at chase rate, Jordan has a lower chase rate than everybody else but Mike Trout and Aaron Judge. And my favorite stat besides K rate is whiff rate. If you look at the whiff rate, Jordan has a lower whiff rate than everybody else on this list except for one Mike Trout. So I think it's just so ridiculous that we don't give this guy enough credit for how good he is, not just at the plate, but understanding the strike zone, understanding the pitches and the pitchers that are throwing the pitches. It's incredible what this guy does to the plate, night in and night out, even for a DH. He might go down as one of the best DHs of all time, if not the best DH of all time. He has that kind of potential. Guys, I hope you all enjoyed the video. It was a quick one. Hope to see you on the next one. Don't forget to like the video if you are new and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. My name is Shane and I'll see you.